Okay, go ahead and tell me then what your chief complaints are then. Like this area, the psoas is still, you know, I think I need some work done. Uh, hips, the pronation, I think I was showing you. Yeah, it used to be at a point where I couldn't like do this without feeling it all the way down. Now I got you know, pretty good mobility. So you can look down. Are you gonna just like march in place and stop for me? It's left. Yeah. I'm Unless sorry. the last comes down like this. Yeah, it just went at the pronation. And right now, my weight is more on this side of the foot. Yeah, your hip. It's a hip, right? Yeah. Yeah. Your right hip is just not... No yeah, pain can, there, though, right? Now that I'm unconscious of it, I could feel it. <laughs> yeah, okay. Yeah, you're really pushing into that left. <laughs> yeah. Because and you've had this your whole life. Yes. And it was because you think from being breech. Uh, but you had hip. Breech. Yeah, I was Did that uh, pulled dislocate? out. Oh, you were pulled out by your feet. Right, the leg is actually, huh? you have a hip injury here from being, from your birth, but the hip in general is an extension of the pelvis. You have a left foot flare. I'm gonna assume that your pelvis is turned this way. The anterior tilt, I think was the word that I was And thinking. the anterior tilt would be on the right hand side. It's dropped this way and it wants to go posterior. You're really, boom, and then you're kind of, lifting mm -hmm. and then you boom and then you guard so then i want you to raise your right knee up for me like that about as see it's gonna like for me it's, is that it's weak a lot harder for me to do it this way okay and, and then the other side the other side probably be easier oh yeah way more strength there too okay right. and the other side again mm -hmm. let me see what wants to see. oh interesting i mean the left leg is stronger than the right it's just like the you can do you feel weakness here though when you do that. I wasn't really paying attention to that area. I'll have to try again. It's not dropping. That's called Trendelenburg. Is then the patient does this and they fall because they're weak. That's, so that, that's the... happened to me um, okay. when I was over the years. Like I wouldn't completely fall, but I'd like lose my balance, you know. Mm -hmm. This has gotten better. Um, yeah, this just as a result side, of work, huh? but it's still, you know. Yeah, look at that. Wow. Now that goes into your hip right there. Yeah, I can feel that. A little tighter. Mm, yeah, you're really stuck right here. And this is all, this whole side is stuck. <laughs> this entire left side yeah. is like not moving at all. And the right side has some movement. And then right there, your hip compensates for it. Do you understand? This is stuck down here. When because you're mostly just stuck on the left, all right? Like the whole thing just doesn't, doesn't your SI joint doesn't have much motion. Mm -hmm. But your right side has motion except for one area at the bottom and you don't get into that part which is down here and, to, and it gets stuck right here like right here your bone goes no and so what happens I feel the tendon and the muscle over here engage to get your hip to go yeah it's trying to your hip, pick up the slack yeah and I'm like uh, that's interesting I don't usually hmm. yeah I'm an interesting case and that's <laughs> all from being born and them yanking you huh so I gotta figure out which way. Come on and stand up for me real quickly. Then turn that way. No, it's right here. So he's got it right in here. Lateral curvature here. Perfectly fine here. This is more laterally flexed. All right, come on up, come on up. I know, I've almost got it. I gotta figure out which way your back curves. Because once you lay down, everything changes. <laughs> That's true. It does. It's like, what happened? Okay, and then we're gonna go the other way. It is the tighter way. Are you sure? Maybe not. See, that's with this part of your back. And below the scapula, your back is curved this way. So here, take your arms up over your head, I'll show you. Okay, if I isolate just this, it's gonna be harder to go this way than just this way you like to go. Yeah, I didn't feel as much of a pull in my lat, and that's on the right side. Okay, this way. This I feel all Oh all God, bad. okay. <laughs> Okay. It, was, it wasn't that bad, but, really good, but I could wow. feel it like all here as opposed right. to this side I could barely feel, relatively, you know. It's crazy. It's fine. You're fine. You're going to live. <laughs> you have oh, to I live. I don't want to live. I want to thrive. <laughs> all right. Look to your right as far as you can. Any pain when you do that? Uh, it's, starting, it's a little locked up here, so yeah. Mm -hmm. so I am jostling you around. And then look to the left as far as you can. Same. This side. Kind of where you pointed to earlier. It's like ear to your shoulder as far as you can. It just, no, nope, yeah, can't do it. Here. Okay, and then to the other side. Locked here. Yeah, yeah that's that left atlas. Mm -hmm. Okay, on your back, face up for me. Mm -hmm. 
No trigger points up here. Trigger points here. Yeah. You have great flexibility though. So recent development. Yeah. Yeah, but like all of the muscles are just like mm, mm -hmm. not there. So if you if you're gonna get anything out of this, because right here, there's no real big knots because of all the work you've had done. Mm -hmm. This here, oh my chair is C zero. C zero. <laughs> C zero and C one. Right there. Look at that. Love it. That ain't moving like it's supposed to. Mm-mm. Before, this is very important. What's that? See his foot flare, his left foot flare there, okay? That's how he wants to be. Before I adjust him, <laughs> we're gonna turn it in. Like that, there you go. Okay. It's incredible. Okay, okay chin back. Ooh, nice. Right here. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Chin back. That What that does is it allows me to close the joints a little further. So I can do that. Oh, that one smarted me a bit. It's like it's a... Uh, oh, it feels great. It's just congested right here and I can't quite... Oh, it feels great. Okay, that's where you want to be. Mm -hmm. That left side is just all pulling. I sit here and I wiggle it. That's it. How are you doing? Oh, I feel fine. Okay. There's no pain or anything. This also tells me where you're placing your weight. That makes sense. So it's part of my evaluation. Oof. <laughs> that was... Big one, huh? Yeah. The funny thing is I cracked them right before we started. Not like that, though. <laughs> just like push them against the floor. Well, I'm getting some of that those deeper levels. You can always get more. Okay. Can't get the baby toe. No. Oh, you got it. I did? Yep, I felt I didn't it. feel it. It was it wasn't a loud one, but it was a uh, I heard a pop. Okay. I felt it. You tell me if you're hurting. Oops. Oh you got it. you gotta pop through too. Oh, well, it's not it's what fine. I want, but that's fine, I'll take it. That, bend the knee and make it move. There you go. Okay, cool. Let me do the good side first. Okay, that was the hip. See how it doesn't really crack? Oh, uh, it was right here. One. Yes, but it doesn't. Oh yeah, I, I, got, I got what you're saying. Yeah, it wasn't. A big pop. I need to use my scientific terms. <laughs> it didn't cavitate. Didn't cavitate. <laughs> All right, very careful. Well, it has integrity. There. You okay. <laughs> that I felt in the lower spine. Yeah, you're right. It's right here. Yep, there it is. That was good. Woo! There it goes. Yeah, you do have a high pain tolerance. Now, for this one, remember, I had the head back. You're going to look back, and that protects your neck. So look at that. Yeah. yeah. Yep. See, there it is. It's also going to go. Okay. I can, you want me to breathe in real deep and try to work time? You want me to go further? I can always ob oblige. <laughs> okay, go. But your bottom leg has to be straight. The bottom one. Yeah, I pivot around that. No, I think that's it. That's it. That's all the SI joint's gonna go. Gotcha. Okay. I don't want the low back. Yeah. Oh, you got a big trigger point there. Oh yeah, felt it. It's getting a lot better though. It, it does change. Yeah, I can. I can you can feel, feel it. it loosening up. You know, it's not like it's this cement. So you got one here. I can feel it. Yep. And if I want any hope in adjusting that SI joint. You've got to get the lateral muscles free. And he's got a lump here. Oh, yeah. And I don't, just general tightness lower than that. That's common. On your other side, it was where? Down here at the knee. Yes. Yeah. Here, it's up here in the TFL. Normal variation. That's a normal variant. A lot of people have this. When you came in here, you knew you had it, that oh, yeah. anterior pelvic tilt, okay? Yeah. You, but I think you're only truly anterior on your right hand side. I'm gonna show you in a second. Perfect. That's it, it's all gonna go. Nice, you got two there. 
Oh yeah, that was up superior and inferior aspect of the joint. Nice. Over here, it was just the inferior. That's all that needed to go. It's okay. Um, Very cool. We're gonna go face down. All right, so you're gonna lift this leg up as high as you can. It's just straight back. Yep, and okay, and down. And this leg, back. Ooh, you popped your own pelvis there again. <laughs> that was the knee. Oh, it was the knee. Yeah, I, I felt oh, it all the oh, way got, up here. I got cartilage in the knee, ready? Yep. Oh, it reverberates all the way up into my Rusty hand. injury, yeah. Wow. In the, yeah, ninth grade. This, this feels much more balanced now, okay? So. Awesome. Well, yeah, I could feel it there. It's definitely not. Oh, I haven't like, I haven't given my full strength. Oh, I'm just warming oh, it up. <laughs> I know. <laughs> it's not like I was. I was just like, what does this have in it? I already know what you're capable of. Oh really? <laughs> <laughs> lots of mass destruction. Lots, lots of pain. <laughs> Ooh, feel that on the left. Oh my gosh, yeah. Oof. Good flexibility though. It's just that's a scar. To, see that on the left? That's it's all yeah. right here on him. Like look at that. Right there. You'll see it flinch. Mm, and that pulls all the way out. <laughs> wow. Oh my goodness, how far up does it go? Right here, still on the left. See how there's nothing, nothing over on here the on the right. right? Nothing. No, it's all here. Several ribs out. One, two. Oh, shut up out there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Take me a little bit. But that's that lateral curvature. When you bent forward, you were out over here. Oh, okay. yeah, you're right. So it's, Makes sense. So it's not like, oh, he's mismatched. No, yeah, everything's right. pretty straightforward. As far as from a chiropractic point of view. Yeah. You know, nothing's like, I'm just surprised at how much scar tissue you have. <laughs> I'm like, really? Is that scar tissue or is this just rib displacement? <laughs> like, what the heck? Put the rib back in place. <laughs> well, I'm going to. Let me try. Deep breath in. All the way out. Who? Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm going right here. I'm still staying on this set. Well, let me breathe in again. Give me one. I want to see how I can approach this without, because you're very sensitive to muscle, you know, spasm. So I have to go just exactly. So, deep breath in and out. See that? Wow. And again. Those are gonna give me some trouble. It's okay. Deep breath in again. Wow. So we just got one. Well, no, I, several. We like two, several. two regions, I should, <laughs> I should say. Here we go. Breathe. And out, out, out. Good. And again. Yeah, there you go. Oh, crap. There's another one down here. <laughs> I missed it. <laughs> it's right there on the left. Let me get a little air first. Okay. Go. Okay. There's nothing much up here. Right there. Just there. Okay, I'm just going to put pressure. Pressure. Short sips of air. Here we go. Let it out. Yeah. Yeah, you're ready. That's about as far in as it goes. Again, I'm gonna push. That's about as far in as those bones wanna go. I can feel that as far as far as it goes. That's <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna make them go. <laughs> Even if they don't want to. Oh man. Yeah, there you go. That's it. 
That's gonna take my elbow, though. It, it wants to. Just can't. This thing is not pointy enough. We need the elbow. There's a little bit of adhesion. It's right there. Oh, yeah. There it is. It's gonna come in here. Ooh, wee. Yeah, take your time in that area. <laughs> if I bot, I'll release you. It's okay. I will, re it's okay. I will release you if you stay. Oh, we've got. Um, the body quits on me after a little while, and so I go back and forth. Mm -hmm. Let me push down. Breathe. Let me see it. It just lets me look at it. Hey. That, oh, I'm sorry at the end, but that looks really good. Again. When I hold down here, it's fascinating. Um, this spot, your spine becomes straight. Hmm. Are you okay? I'm just trying to breathe more. The pain's fine. Okay. Yeah, I don't mind you flexing the rib cage as we go. Oh, what? Did you get hit here or something? No, it's just, uh, again, you know. All those many years of bodybuilding with asymmetry. Really? You just That's from cause, such a young age. A lot of issues. There we go. Oh, this is working. Oh, it is, definitely. Well, I, I can feel you breaking into it more. Ugh. Tuck your chin for me a little bit. Here we go. <laughs> scar upon scar. Oh yeah. Oh, from weightlifting. Four, four lateral raises, no doubt. Just gotta. Oh yeah, geez, that's tender. You just got a little bit. There you go. Hey, hey, hey. There you go. I don't want you to turn it too much. Can you look straight down on top with your forehead? Mm -hmm. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Now I can get in there. But out of all the spots on your back. What? This is the most petechiae. Petechiae? Petechiae is the bruising. Wow. The gua sha, the shaw. Makes sense, because this is an area I never get hit, really. <laughs> okay, so we found one. <laughs> oh, you found you, you got, you got a couple spots that are pretty unusual. You. Oof. Who? What in the world? <laughs> How far down does this thing go? Yeah. It's been a while since I've seen somebody's whole infraspinatus bruise. Is this an area you usually hit with people? Yes. So it's like, whoa. Usually I get a little pebble, like a little mark here. Oh, yeah? On you, it's the whole, well, into your teres. You can see his muscles. Here's his teres major and minor. Here's his lat coming up here. Infraspinatus is right here. See, here's the spine of his scapula. He's got great range of motion, though. That first 60 degrees, you've got it. You know, I mean, most people cannot do this. Their scapulars are still back over here. Here's the border of your scapula. It's doing what it should be doing. One thing I've always been pretty decent with is keeping a good range of motion in that area. It's the, the hips that were the, <laughs> made up for it. <laughs> okay. Well, we're going to check it in a second. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to let you have it. I usually don't film that. I can't show skin down there. So I use the roller and I just smash you. Yeah, there you gotta do. <laughs> you 
came to well, smash right that there. smash. That's another, you found another area right there. Yeah, it's just... Like that whole part is just dropped Yeah, in. just whatever. That's awesome. You can do your whole body if you wanted. You could come down here and do the whole lat. You know what I usually will tell guys is here, come on your side, mm -hmm. face me. That. Yeah. That is uh, scar left. tissue, fascia. Uh, fascia mostly. Little tiny scar tissues. And the, the fascia gets torn. It's so delicate, yeah. you know, and it just gets ripped apart. And the body's like, well, let me put some glue in there. And then that inhibits your range of motion. Mm -hmm. That little one there. It makes you feel better. Woo. Now keep that arm up over. Give me some tension because I don't have the tissue pull unless you do that. There we go. Is this hurting you? Yeah, it's nice. I mean, you can feel it, but I don't mind it. Ah, oh, some people do like dry rubbing. Ooh. With, with a thin edge like that, I would think it would break the skin. I would think so too. Uh -huh. No, I grease you up pretty, pretty well. <laughs> like, well yeah, you, you, you do a great job with that, absolutely. I never really use that. Again. Um, it's because. too superficial. You need a piece of steel. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> you need a piece of steel. It just makes my job easier because I just lay the weight down. Well, the, yeah, plus you, it the plastic for you, so you can put more strength and less worry about like, you know, the tighter you grip, the more, you're gonna pull, you know, more pressure you're gonna apply. Yeah, yeah. You have a tiny bit here. Raise that arm up over there a little bit more. Yeah. Can you? I feel it though. I can feel it. It's not as bad over here, not by a long shot, but you know. But I, but I do feel tenderness, you know. I like being to work in that area, but I feel like I need it. Right there, that's crazy, you know? I can feel it. It's not in the crevice of your humerus, just the posterior delt, interesting. And it's not over here, turn a little bit towards me and sure. kind of flip over because there's nothing in your lats. <laughs> it's right okay. here. It's just right here. Yeah, I can feel it. Uh, Is that it? Nothing in here? I mean, I know you hear it, but the, there's nothing that's going to come out here. Oh, no, definitely not. Is that you know? right here? That, that, the, the one where you were hitting, though? I think that was like, I was feeling that. Damn. That's all you got, though. I've searched. Incredible. You can see the knots in his legs. Oh, yeah. There it goes. Sorry. <sighs> All right. Here's your shirt. All right. Arms. Yeah, we haven't done elbows or anything like that. That's it. How are you feeling? You all right? Oh, yeah. I mushed you into the table, so. <laughs> it's like unsticking yourself. <laughs> Some of them for me. <laughs> yeah, I do every day. Yeah, because he's he's not like that clicky. Well, there it was, but <laughs> that was it. <laughs> Probably in a way. Oh. No, there's nothing there. Yeah, you take care of the rest. Yeah, no, no, no. It's gonna feel like you're cramping right in your rib cage. It's not the rib cage. It's oh, you mean the back of the rib cage, mm -hmm. not the front. <laughs> yeah, they wrap like, around the back. It's feel like the front of it broke, you know? <laughs> no, no, no. Right here, it's going to feel stiff. Yeah, it does. And as long as it's not here. <laughs> when you hit that area, whoop. <laughs> yeah, but do you see how inflexible you are? Yeah. So that's why we do the massage. You drain it and you feel better. But it's going to keep filling up if you don't get the stress off of it. Yeah, that makes sense. 
And just walk normally. Yeah, it's pushing now. Wow. Much better. I can feel it. Oh, over there. I mean, on the first couple steps. we had the original footage, so. But that right there. That. that Amazing. Right. Yeah. Very good. Uh, no more reverse lunges for me. 